Hello, and welcome back to the Worst Possible Commander Show. It's me, it's CGB, and I... I <laughs> the hell are you doing? No, dude, just practicing. <laughs> that is very distracting. Oh. How dare you take focus away from Ben? Because it's Ben's 30th birthday today. Yay! Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so uh, send your birthday wishes to our beloved Ben, who has been here for almost every episode. Have you missed an episode? Just when I was gone. <laughs> That's the time to miss it. When Gina subbed for me, I guess. What yeah. would we do without this man? Yes. <laughs> Where would the show be without this? <laughs> so uh, we are very excited to help celebrate your birthday in the worst possible way here on the Worst Possible <laughs> Commander Show, where we go around and talk about the worst things our decks can do to each other. Hi, in case you missed it, I'm CGB, and I'm here with my friends. This is Ben. Hello. Birthday Ben. And this is Blake. Hello. And this is Shay. Hello. And our show is sponsored by Cool Stuff Inc. Com. Use the promo code WORST to get a discount and you can get 5% uh, off all of your singles and any birthday gifts that you might get for friends. That is also very useful. Ben's and, my friend. And we're also sponsored by Ultimate Guard and that is the only company whose products we use to protect our magic cards. And I'm, I'm sure, Ben, uh, I'm sure they got you something nice for your birthday, right? Yeah, totally. Totally did. That's right. <laughs> Not making this up on the spot. <laughs> Not getting awkward at all. Anyway, the worst possible thing I'm going to do to you today is surveillance. Hmm. Hmm, I'm playing Mirko, Obsessed Theorist. This is a Demir commander who gets bigger whenever I surveil, and at each end step I can return creatures with power less than Mirko's from the graveyard to the battlefield. This is a clone deck. I have a bunch of zero power creatures I'm going to put in my <laughs> graveyard and then return to the battlefield. So even if I don't surveil in my surveil deck, I'm still gonna get value. <laughs> and the worst possible thing I can probably do is offend Reddit by pointing out that they're all little obsessed theorists and uh, also play Gyruda and clone it multiple times. I could literally potentially with the amount of clones in this deck if I got lucky enough a Gyruda could copy itself again and again and again and again and Gyruda Doom of Depths times however many copies I make could mill the whole table. Oof. That would be fun. That'd be crazy. That'd be a wonderful birthday for Ben. He would be impressed. Nope. I think he wants this. You, you better have a consuming apparition in there. He doesn't. <laughs> That's a Ben card. Yeah, definitely. 100%. He wouldn't even put it on your birthday. That is way too Timmy for me. <laughs> <laughs> but Ben, show us what you like for your birthday. Uh, I'm playing the Pride of Holclade. It's a big 11 drop, but it's also Whoa. it's also a crocodile elk turtle, just so we know. Oh, I love it's oh, a, that's amazing. It's also a 215. So this spell costs X less Big. to cast, where X is a total toughness of creatures you control. It has Defender for two blue and two. Until end of turn, target creature I control gets plus one, plus O, oh, gains whenever this creature deals combat damage to a player, draw cards equal to its toughness. Blake. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and can attack as though it didn't have Defender. So I have like a lot of... What? Yeah, I like... No, I was going to say I like that. Yeah. So I have a lot of defenders. I have assault formation and tower defense for my worst possible. Just kind of raw, like Shay likes to do with Crater Hoof, but with defenders. Nice. Ben. What? Ben. ben. How long yeah. have we been doing this? Long time. Long time, Ben. Like long over two time. Years, yeah. 100 episodes is coming up, Ben. Ben, yeah. I said, let's see what Ben likes for his birthday. <laughs> ben. It was a softball. You were supposed to say, I like big butts, and I cannot lie. <laughs> and I couldn't deny, so. That would have been a good joke if I had thought about it. <laughs> and now here I am living in the cringe that is a missed softball. Blake, help. Save us. Do something, Blake. We got a bear, scriptwriters more. <laughs> So I'm playing Morska Undersea Sleuth. So this is Bant for a 2-3. I have no maximum hand size. The beginning of my upkeep, investigate, make a clue. Whenever I draw my second card each turn, put two plus one plus one counters on Morska Undersea Sleuth. So I'm gonna be doing what I love most and drawing a ton of cards with a ton of clues. From there, I kind of have two options. Either I could make a huge Morska, give it unblockable and hexproof and kill you guys with commander damage. But depending on how it goes, I might just want to cast Rise and Shine and animate like 20 clues and use those to kill you. Hmm. 
It's gonna be great. Like, yeah. I've never been less afraid of a worst possible in my <laughs> life. Do you know why? Do you know why? Tell me. Because you're not gonna have any clues. You can't resist cracking clues to draw cards. You're gonna play Cyber Drive Awakener on an empty board. It's gonna be a 4 4 flyer. <laughs> I know better. I know this man. I'm gonna try to try to be strong and not crack every clue. <laughs> it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Uh, speaking of what's not gonna happen, we're not gonna get hit by a crater hoof. That's true. <laughs> so, Shay, unless he's got it. No. So Shay, what are you playing? <laughs> uh, today I'm playing Judith, Carnage Connoisseur. Um, and it's funny that we were talking about big butts earlier because I like to call her Big Booty Judy. Because she's a 3-4 she's a and I think that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's the biggest booty this Judy has had. She's been doing squats in the off season. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Um, so yeah, she says whenever you cast an instant or a sorcery spell, choose one. That spell gains death touch and life link. Um, or create a 2-2 red imp creature token. When this creature dies, it deals two damage to each opponent. I know what you're thinking. You're like, she's gonna go for the imps. She's gonna make a bunch of imps. But actually the deck is built around the death touch and the lifelink. Mm. Um, so for my worst possible, I've got a blasphemous act. You know it, you love it. Uh, with a repercussion, which says whenever a creature's dealt damage, repercussion deals that much damage to that creature's controller in combination with veto. Uh -huh. uh, so I'm gonna try to deal a ton of damage on the board across yeah. creatures, but then really deal that damage to you and then gain a bunch of life, but then deal more damage to you <laughs> from the life that I gain. Jesus. Interesting. <laughs> mm. huh. Very interesting. And it's gross because death touch means that it would only take one damage to kill all our stuff. It's dealing 13 just because it can. It just it yeah. Can. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. When she chooses Death Touch, is she Big Booty Judy with cooties? <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> Somebody save us from Please this Please end this intro! intro. <laughs> Let's dive in. Let the nonsense begin. Shay, Shay, take it away. All right, <laughs> we'll draw for turn. Beautiful. I try. I Great. sit here just, I loved it. all I do is think about where to let it just go. <laughs> I'm gonna play a mountain as my land for turn, and guess what? Yeah. Cap it for a soul ring. Yeah. Whoa. Dang. Here we go. Yo. Uh, then I'm gonna pass the turn. I will draw. I don't know if this is gonna get me attacked. It bettered out with a soul ring on the battlefield. I'm gonna play a tapped, serialized watery grave. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> number 260. Wow. Your Great turn, number. Ben. Great number. Damn. <laughs> I'm gonna play an island and pass. All right, I will draw for turn. It's turn one. <laughs> What, just jump my hand back. <laughs> I will play a flooded trend and crack it. All right, I'm gonna shotgun in an unserialized temple garden like a peasant. <laughs> wow, you even take damage for that? You what? Wow. You play a soul ring and pass the turn. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice soul ring, yeah. Twinning. Twinning. Untap. Here's Draw. Name today. I'll play a swamp as my land for turn. <laughs> Uh, okay, then I'm gonna pay four for a primal amulet. Jeez. Okay. Wow. That's a stormy card. Uh, then I'll pass. Untap, draw. Morphic pool. Pass. Okay. Sick deck. Thank you. <laughs> Mine? <laughs> I'm gonna play a Hinterland Harbor. Uh, tap two for a three visit. Nice. Got a tropical island that'll under untap. Your turn, Blake. All right, I will untap. Draw for turn. I'll play a cool hinterland harbor. Float one with the soul ring to cast a far seek. All right, with my far seek, I got Spar's quarters. With my floating soul ring mana and the hinterland harbor, I will play an Erdwall Illuminator. Uh, it's a 1-3 flyer. Whenever I investigate for the first time each turn, investigate an additional time. Ooh. And I'll pass. Cool. Cool. 
<laughs> All right, on the tail end of uh, Blake Sass, I'll untap. And I'm draw. <laughs> the tail end of his what? <laughs> <laughs> we are terrible today. We are. I'm going to play Reliquary Towers, my land for turn. I'm going to tap five to cast Judith. AKA Big Booty Judy. Big Booty Judy. <laughs> In the house. Indeed. Then I'll pass the turn. Untap, nothing. Draw. House. Swamp. Commanda. Obsessed Theorist. 1 3 Flying Vigilance. Done. Untap. Draw for turn. I'm going to play a forest. I'll tap three for a Chasm Skulker. Whenever I draw a card, I put a 1 1 counter on him, and when he dies, I create X 1 1 blue squid creature tokens with Island Walk where X is the number of one-on counters on him. Go ahead, Blake. All right, I'm gonna untap, draw for turn. I'll play an island. Floating one from the soul ring, I will play ongoing investigation. Whenever one or more creatures I control deal combat damage to a player, I investigate. And then I can pay two and exile a creature card from my graveyard to investigate and gain two life. Uh, so that's cool. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Then I will cast my commander. Still floating one from the soul ring. Uh, if that resolves though, I'm going to go to combat, losing my one floating. Shay? Mm-hmm. Big booty Judy, her booty keeps her close to the ground, right? She, uh, she doesn't jump very far, <laughs> but I'm sending a flyer. So no, her booty does not have reach. <laughs> That's what I wanna know. How thick? Wow. One three flyer at you. Yeah, no blocks. All right, I will investigate twice because of the illuminator, and I'll pass. Shay, yep. before it gets to your turn, mm -hmm. I'm going to ask you a question. Yeah. You do not have to answer it, but a failure to answer will, you know, kind of tell me what I need to know. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to kill everything with that commander already? I do not have a plan to kill everything with the commander already. Currently. That wasn't like the most. I, I don't feel Well, she hasn't drawn her card for turn. Yeah, yeah I see. I think that's as fair as she can give me in this position. <laughs> Shay, go ahead. Untap and draw. Shay, before the end of your draw step, <laughs> <laughs> you have a plan to kill everything with your commander this turn. No, I don't. Okay, proceed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to play Sulphur Springs as my land for turn. I'll pay two for a Firebrand Archer. Whenever you cast a non-creature spell, Firebrand Archer deals one damage to each opponent. Okay. Not your creatures. Not your creatures. I mean, correct. Still not pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> Still not pleasant. Then I will pay one black to cast a Night Feeder's Visitation, AKA Night's Whisper, and I will draw two cards and lose two life. So that is a sorcery spell, so I get a trigger from my commander. Um, so with the Judith trigger, I'm going to choose to create a 2-2 red imp. And then I will get a charge counter on my primal amulet and I'll uh, lose two life and draw two cards. And then because I cast a non-creature spell, uh, Firebrand Archer is gonna deal one damage to everybody. Bang, bang, bang. She cast one spell and gets 50 triggers. That's crazy. <laughs> that was a lot, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Then I'm going to tap my Sulphurous Springs for a black and take one damage. Well, there we go. For a Feed the Swarm. Uh-huh. Targeting. What's uh, it targeting? Targeting Blake's Shay? commander. Ooh. Shots fired. Okay, Shay. Shay, okay. <laughs> okay, Shay. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's, there's triggers. Yeah, there's oh, lots yeah. of things happening. I have to wait before my commander dies. So <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> Uh, okay, that's a sorcery spell. I've got a Judith. Ju <laughs> that's a sorcery spell, so I've got a Judith trigger. Uh, I'm gonna make another imp. Boop. Doesn't even say once a turn. Just make more of those. I know. Yeah, oh, just make wow. more of those. Uh, then I'll get another charge counter on the amulet, and then that's gonna be another damage to each opponent Ow. from the archer. Okay, and then the Feed the Swarm happens, and I will lose three life. Blake, responses? Mm. No. <laughs> okay. All right, and then I think I tortured Blake enough, so I'm gonna move to combat. I'm gonna send Judy to CGB. Are you sure? Yeah. 
Well, if she's not gonna kill everything this turn, she probably will do it next turn and you poked me, so I guess we're going to deadly raw like your commander then. Wow. Yep, exile. Okay, I think that's fair enough. Okay, well, that's all for me. Pass to you, CGB. Untap, draw. Tap three, notion rain, notion rain. I'm going to take two damage and surveil two and then draw two. You guys remember the song Chocolate Rain? Yeah. Some stay dry. And others feel the pain. <laughs> I'll bin one, keep one, and draw two. Mm -hmm. I have surveilled. I'll put a plus one, plus one counter on the commander. I'll play this island. I'll tap it, and we'll cast Consider, Surveil, and then draw a card. I'll draw that card. Unfortunately, I have failed to bin anything awesome to get back with my commander, though. I'll move to combat. I have a 3-5 flyer. Shay, mm -hmm. punch you back. Yep. Ha! Pass the turn <laughs> to Ben. Untap. Draw for turn. Gets a counter on Chasm Skulker. And play a forest. Tap in five for a psychosis crawler. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Whenever you draw a card, each opponent yeah. loses one life, power and toughness equal cards in your hand. So okay. it's a five, five, a four, four right now. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's up, Blake? Two, two, <sighs> coming at you. All right, I'll take two. And now it's your <clears throat> turn, sir. All right, I will untap. I play planes. Crack that clue. Crack that clue. Crack, Crack that clue. Crack that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I will spend five to replay Morska. Nice. Gonna go to combat. Hey Ben, what's up? One. Oh, it's a flyer, darn. Yeah. <laughs> didn't oh play man. For that. Sure didn't. And I will get two clues from that. Um, before I end my turn, I will crack one of the clues to draw a card and put two plus one plus one counters on Morska. Uh, now that I have done all of those lovely things, I'm gonna pass to Shay. Sounds good, I'll untap. I'm gonna play a Myriad Landscape as my land for turn. Uh, then I'll pay five for a Revel and Riches. Mm. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Guys, hmm. guys. Uh, and then that's a non-creature spell, so the archer's gonna trigger, dealing one damage to you all. Ping. Uh, I'll pass to CGB. You've changed. <laughs> <laughs> Did an all-out attack, wah. What? Who's the threat? Well, I'll just chill. That's... You have to decide that one for yourself, and it's that's, not me. It's tough. <laughs> no, it could be tough. This but is tough. Maybe it's not me. I'm not sure. Look into your heart. What would Ben do? Well, what that's... would the birthday boy do? <laughs> what what's Here. casual? I'll no give you a dice to roll. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> that's how Ben makes it. Highest life total. Ben, take three. Uh, <laughs> oh, that is the right move. Yeah, that uh, is that's true. Fine. That's that's hoisted on his own petard. <laughs> Commander, huh? Nice. You know it. You know it. I'm a D20. So the point was to surveil these cards into the graveyard, but I keep drawing them. <laughs> after the surveils yeah. instead. <laughs> and it's a little cringe, but whatever. Spark double my commander. And pass the turn to Shay. What? Nope. What? And pass the turn to Ben. I just want a shorter turn cycle. <laughs> we're playing Uno, we're reversing, <laughs> reverse card. <laughs> yeah, I'll intent. I'll draw a card, putting a 1-1 one -one counter on Chasm Skunk. And we each lose one? And you each lose a life. Uh, uh, these pings. What is going on? I'm gonna tap two for a crashing drawbridge. Zero four defender, tap it. Creatures you control gain haste until end of turn. Whoa. I'll play a rogue's passage for turn. I will tap one forest and cast my commander because I have 10 toughness and he's reduced by that. So the 215 has arrived. The 215 has Dying. arrived. Judy's booty just got so outclassed. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. That's true. By That's this true. crocodile crocodile elk turtle. <laughs> Go ahead, Blake. All right, I'm gonna untap. In my upkeep, I will get two clues because of Morska plus the Illuminator. And I will draw for turn. 
Then how about you and I do the Spider-Man meme here? Wait, what? In about two seconds. He's gonna play a Psychosis Crawler. Oh. And I'm gonna play a Psychosis Crawler. I knew it! <laughs> nice. <laughs> wow. But mine looks so cool. All right, I will then play a tapped Hollowed Fountain. And I'm gonna spend two, and I'm gonna crack one of my clues to draw a card. This will give Morska two plus one plus one counters, and everyone will lose a life. Uh, oh yeah, huge deal. You're dead. I don't know, this is gonna add up it's really adding fast. Up. Yeah. <laughs> it's adding up. I'm gonna move to combat. I'm gonna send, oh Ben, one in the air at you, pal. Right, that guy doesn't have reach. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, wait, yeah. booties don't necessarily have reach. All booties this. have reach, bro. <laughs> I'll take the one. I will make a clue off of the uh, ongoing investigation, and I'll pass the turn. Okay, I'll uh, untap. Um, I'm gonna tap my soul ring to crack my myriad landscape. Uh, okay, I grabbed two mountains with myriad landscape. That'll pay two for a Kessig Flame Breather. Just another archer. More Just pinging. Just another one. <laughs> oh, jeez. Where's your pings, bro? I, yeah. I, apparently <laughs> I'm not good at it. <laughs> wasn't wasn't blessed with the pinging life. Never forget the pinger deck I played, Ben. You, <laughs> yeah, that was so funny. Oh my I never God. fucking forget. It. The it funny so thing funny. about it, she's already doing better than that whole deck. <laughs> <laughs> Always forget that. Uh, <laughs> pass the turn. Untap and draw. Do you surveil? All right, tap for a blue. Yeah. You're right, you're right. I'm sorry, are you busy? No. <laughs> you have something to do here. I'm, what is this sign language? I don't know. I just don't bet he's dead. That's Cringe. All, all right. All right, otherworldly gaze. So it, this does not say surveil, but the newest update says surveil three. Oh, it's the one with flashback? Yeah. Nice. I'm good at magic. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, let's bend them all. We've got a ravenous chupacabra and an arcane signet and a land. And that is plus one, plus one counter here and plus one, plus one counter here. Let's do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to flash back otherworldly gaze for a new instance of surveil. Look at top three. It's a good surveil card, jeez. I will bin reliquary tower. I will keep the other two. Hmm. 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 <coughs> oh, what's this, she? <laughs> <laughs> That's two uh, plus one plus one counter on each of my obsessed theorists. How big's your psychosis, Crawler? Mine's a four four. Mine's ben. a three three. How big's your commander, Blake? Mine's a six seven. A six seven. That's very large. That is a Thank big you. commander. You should be proud of Tell yourself. Tell me more. Keep telling. Yeah, keep telling. Yeah. <laughs> Love it. I could do something that would wipe out all the small creatures, which would be very satisfying. Do the it. problem is it leaves Shay with no blockers for the pride of the whole clay drawing 15. <laughs> which could be a problem. Yeah, you need a dark creature on the shield right now. That just, I mean, I know it's his birthday, yeah. but that's a little too nice. <laughs> All right, going to combat. Let's look at the players with the highest life total, as CGB now Maybe. does. Yeah. And let's attack. Uh, uh, Blake, you get the the uh, attack with four counters, so that's five total commander damage. And Ben, you're going to get four commander damage. Well, four damage, not yeah. commander damage. Copy of my commander, not my commander. I'll take it. Not to be confused with my commander. I'm confused. So. <laughs> Post combat, we'll play this command tower. We'll tap these and we'll play a Toxic Deluge. Yeah. Paying how much life? Well, that's the thing. How many cards, Ben? Three. And how many cards, Blake? Four. And how much open mana? Zero. Three. All right. We're going to pay four life and give minus four, minus four to the board. I'll go down to 29. Okay. So uh, on this board, these will die. You will. Okay, over here. Everything dies. But there are death triggers on those amps. There are death triggers. So that's gonna be four damage total to everybody <gasps> when they die. And then also, between Ben and Blake, how many creatures died? Mm, two for me. I had three die. 
So I will make five treasures. Oh yeah. Oh Jesus. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh. I'm down to 25 as well. And as a reminder, on my upkeep, if I control 10 or more, I win the game. Oh, it, yeah, that's, that's a good reminder. Good reminder, good reminder. Um, crap. Mm -hmm. I'll move to my end step. I'll go to get back my ravenous chupacabra to destroy Ben's pride of the whole clade. And then I'm going to just casually remember that my commander only has one power right now and can't do that because of my toxic <laughs> deluge. Oh, that's funny. And Ooh. I'm going to play it off really cool like, happy birthday, Ben. Have fun. Oh, your turn. At your end step, because Shay already made five treasures, and I don't want to lose to an enchantment. I hate losing to enchantments. Yeah. People are so afraid of riches. But I'm going to give you a present with it, Shay, and beast within your revel and riches. Destroy target permanent, you get a 3-3 three, three wow. green beast, beastie boy. Bummer, dude. Okay. I'll untap. Draw for turn. I'm going to tap two and play a growth spiral. Got a land? I do have a land. Breeding pool. Don't have another one. <laughs> I'll tap two for an arcane signet. I'll swing one tentacle, or oh, squid. With Island Walk actually at CGB and one at Blake. Unblockable. Island Walk. Dang, show show dude. what's up. And I'll pass to you, Blake. <laughs> the pinging continues. I know. <laughs> yeah. Why these pings? I'm gonna untap. In my upkeep, I will make a single clue. And I'll draw for turn. Crack a clue. <laughs> Crack a clue. <laughs> oh, I'm Crack gonna. a clue. All right, I'm gonna start by cracking a clue. Draw a card and put two plus one plus one counters on Morska. I'm gonna pay three for a nettle cyst. Ah. So enter. All right, so this is a six, seven, seven right now. Mmm. Ew. Mmm. <laughs> All right, I'm going to attack Ben mm. for eight commander. Happy birthday. He's got a 15 booty blocker. <laughs> that card doesn't look, it doesn't look like a fucking creature, dude. It doesn't, I swear to God. It's oh, turning me off That's every game time I do, baby. Uh, well, I already did it, so. Okay, I'll block it. All right. <laughs> yeah, that was a good block. Nice. Thanks. One of your best. I'll pass. <laughs> okay, I'll untap. Okay, I'm going to pay seven to cast a Judith. Oh boy. She back, she back. Sure, I would consider you a carnage connoisseur. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Yep. I'm gonna pass. What? 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 Sus. All right, uh, I'm taking it. Untap draw. <laughs> hmm. And you've got six open mana over there, Judy Booty. Yep. <laughs> oh, I don't like you. I don't like you. I'm gonna cast a phantasmal image. Copying. If that enters the battlefield, I'm going to choose the pride of the whole clay. <laughs> nice. Nice. I'm going to move to combat. I'm going to attack Ben with Mirko Obsessed Theorist and Blake with Spark Double of Mirko Obsessed Theorist. Yeah. <clears throat> no blocks. No blocks. I'll take three. Before damage, I'm going to activate the Pride of the Whole Clade. I'm going to give my Spark Double, because I'm sus, a bonus from the Pride of the Whole Clade. So this will become a 5-7, and if it hits, I will draw cards equal to its toughness. Sheesh. Responses? All I know is you're dead next turn. What? What'd I do? <laughs> what? You take me. I'll take five if you have no boxes. I mean, I'm just yeah. checking for effects. Yep. No. All right, and I'll draw six cards because that's his toughness. <sighs> now, how many free oh, cards Oh, Ben, your in? commander is fun! How many free yeah. cards is he playing in this I didn't six like deck it. of his? I didn't like it that he got to do it before I did. I know. <laughs> that was, uh... No likey. No likey, but no I do likey. like that I drew you cards because I was looking forward to that. <laughs> I'm gonna play a new land under city sewers, and I'm gonna surveil one. Ah! Wow! Look at, wow. Look at, look at, look at, look at 
I'm gonna leave that on top. And because I surveilled, I will get a plus one, plus one counter on each of my commander. I will move to my end step and I will trigger my commander. I'll trigger the other one as well, but there's only one creature in the graveyard, so I'll target it twice. I'm going to bring out a ravenous chupacabra. And since Blake is talking about killing me for drawing cards, <laughs> I'm taking out your commander. Language, Blake. <laughs> I said it out loud. <laughs> I will respond. Yeah. I'm gonna pay three. I'm gonna cast a disorder in the court for X equals one, targeting my commander. So I will exile one creature, X of, investigate one time, and then I will return to the battlefield tapped at the beginning of your end step. Oh. Hmm. Okay. So I will investigate. Yeah. This goes away. Uh huh. Can go there. That seems so bad for you. I was hoping to exile your creatures and then murder you. So yeah, I, I, <laughs> I wasn't hoping for that. So right. like, I'm I'm weirdly okay with this. All right, it's fair. Uh, all right, I'm going to move to clean up. Oh, you're in your end step. I no, am in my end step. Back and not back coming back, back right now. <laughs> I'll discard a vizier of many faces and an auton soldier, a pair, a couple of zero power clones for some reason. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> and uh, go ahead, Ben. I'll untap. I really wanted to play this after I hit someone, but I think I have to use it as a land, unfortunately. I'm gonna shock in a Seagate Reborn for three life. Bolt You have to bolt it. Yeah, yeah, you gotta bolt it. Bolt in, <laughs> sorry. Lang, yeah. Yeah, it's important. Terminology. It's so. important to get it right. <laughs> My goodness. Get it right, get it right. So I'm gonna tap four uh -huh. to activate his ability on himself. Okay. Awesome. He's a 315 now. Yeah. And I'm gonna make him unblockable with Rogue's Pass. Who are you gonna attack with that? I think it'd be hilarious to attack Blake with him. I do too, Blake, I agree. Because Blake loves drawing <laughs> cards and I'll draw more than him. I you. agree. <laughs> this is a great choice. Take three, Blake. Three but commander. I get, but I get to draw 15 wow. cards. Just let me check really quick. Yep, 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 yep. A whole three, draw 15. <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, He's twelve, be thirteen, after fourteen, this. fifteen. No place. He has more cards than life total. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I do. <laughs> I'm so proud of him. Oh, me too. A little jelly. On your end step, this will return tapped. I will discard nine cards, mostly lands. Go ahead, Blake. Uh, All right. Grip a seven. Hey, it's your turn to draw up to a max hand size, Blake. We both did it. <laughs> Get on tap. Hmm. In my upkeep, I'll make a clue. Nice. Draw for turn. Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Do you guys promise to be cool? <laughs> what I, is that? I, I, yeah. I'm always cool. Always cool. Yeah. Shay's not cool. <laughs> no, she's just not promising to be clear. <laughs> That's not what I heard, bro. <laughs> you know, it depends. It depends what you got cooking. All right. I will start by casting Officious Interrogation. So this is uh, blue and a white. It costs an additional blue and a white for each target beyond the first, so I did it one extra time. I'll choose both of you, and I investigate equal to the total creatures you have, which is like 100. No, it's six, <laughs> seven. six, seven. Yeah. I will go to 14 clues. Wow. Blake, how are you gonna crack all those clues? One at a time, baby. Yeah. I'm gonna tap Sol Ring. That's I'm gonna our crack boy. a clue. That's yeah. our boy. I'm draw a card. <laughs> We're over here drawing like seven to 15 at a pop. Blake's <laughs> like, pay two, draw a card. It's true. But hey, slow and steady. Mm -hmm. That would be something a turtle would say. <laughs> it's true. true. None of your dudes have death touch or anything spoopy? Nope, one's a 215. A little spooky. I know, but my my dude attacks around it, so that's good. <laughs> when I drew uh, my second card off the clue, I will put two counters on Morska. Then I'm gonna go to combat. I'm gonna send Morska at Shea. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna send the Nettle Cyst, which is a 1515 at CGB. 1515? Wow. Yeah. That's enormous. It is. Go to blocks. I'll say no blocks. I'll block with my phantasmal image elk turtle crocodile friend. All right. I'll take four. And my phantasmal image will die and go to the graveyard. 
I'm gonna crack Misty Rainforest. Go to 12. All right, I got a breeding pool. I'm gonna go to 10 to shotgun it in. <laughs> I know. Whew. Don't worry, I'm about to go to nine, so it's all good. <laughs> I'm gonna pay two oh, for a Talisman of Progress. And now, the moment I've all been waiting for, I'm gonna it's pay two. <laughs> yeah. I'm losing a life, and I'm gonna tap six of my 13 clues. For what, improvise? Yes. For <gasps> organic extinction. <laughs> Destroy all non-artifact creatures. Oh. <gasps> Whoa! Get a little booped! Oh, I know. I Blake know. the Quake! <laughs> uh, Shay, responses. I am gonna spend a treasure in response. For red mana, to cast a braid, destroy target artifact. Okay. I would like to target the metal cyst. That makes oh sense. Oh my. Okay, so with the a braid, uh, I've got a Judith trigger. Um, I'm gonna make an imp. And Primal Amulet is going to go up to three charge counters. All right, I have no effects. Ben? Well, All right, Gor organically <laughs> extinct Boom. yourselves. Uh, Ravenous Chupacabra is exiled because of finality counter. My imp deals two damage to everybody when it dies. Ow. All right, I'm gonna pass to you, Shay. Okay, on your end step, Blake. Uh, I really wanted to do this when my commander was out, but I'm gonna do it now, since uh, 10 things just died. Oh, jeez. So I'm gonna tap a swamp, and then two more treasure tokens here to cast a blood for the blood god. <laughs> what nice. have you done, Blake? <laughs> Skulls for the skull throne. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> this will deal eight damage to each opponent. Oh. oh no! I will discard my hand and then draw eight cards. Nice. <laughs> oh, that's Belay. the best blood for the blood god oh, I've ever god. seen. Mine just get wow. countered. <laughs> well, I will die. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Defeated by Corn. Yeah. Eight. <laughs> eight damage. Jeez. Uh, okay. okay. This is gonna be a trigger on the amulet as well, so that'll get another charge. Charge counter. The charge counter. I, 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 ah, I'm just so excited. What is happening? That was a sick turn. No, that was sweet. You so, get to still draw eight fucking cards. Yeah. Okay, so this is going to four, and that means it it transforms into a cool land, primal wellspring. Cool. This is bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then I'm gonna discard my hand, which includes a grape shot and a past in flames. And I will draw eight cards. And blood for the blood god will get exiled. All right, I guess we'll go to my turn. <laughs> no sense asking him if he's done. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, buddy. You mother trucker, bro. <laughs> this, is so, this is so bad. That's all right. That's so brutal. Oh, uh, then I'll draw for turn. As the bestest blood for the blood god of all time. That was pretty <laughs> bloody blood for the blood god. It would have been cooler if I had gained 24 life, but you know, can't be too greedy. All right, let's all just have a little pity party for Shay. <laughs> Tapping nine. Judy's back. <laughs> yep. <laughs> she back. She back. Uh, then I'll play a blight step pathway as my land for turn. I'll use my last two treasures uh, to cast a swift foot boots. And then I will pay one to go to equip it to Judith. Oh, yep. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Nothing for me. <laughs> okay, hexproof and haste. All right, I'm gonna move to combat and I'm gonna swing Judy at Mr. CGB. At Mr. CGB, that's my dad. So <laughs> I take zero damage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, except for these three. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> uh, cool, that's my turn. All right, go to my turn, untap, draw, disinformation campaign. Each opponent discards a card and I draw a card. Hmm. Whenever I surveil, I return it to my hand. Which information campaign? Disinformation campaign. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm gonna discard a fabled passage. Mm hmm. I guess discard tower defense. Oh, the worst possible, man. <gasps> I'm sorry. I'll draw. <laughs> Can't believe it, but here we are. Damnation. 
out of wow. here, Judy. Wow. Shoot. Okay. The one for one. We do what we got to do. Shoot, True. man. Uh, I want to die. That's fair <laughs> enough. All right. Bye, bye, Judy. I will reanimate my commander. <laughs> it's back. I will move to my end step. I will bring back Auton Soldier. This can enter the battlefield as a copy of any creature on the battlefield, but it's not legendary. It's an artifact in addition to other types, and it has Myriad mm. copying my commander. Your turn, Ben. Okay. Untap, draw. I'm gonna play a Reliquary Tower. I'm okay. a great monster. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Oops. I drew it from him. <laughs> I'm gonna tap five for Body of Knowledge. Power and toughness are equal to the number of cards in my hand. I have no maximum hand size. Again. And if it's dealt damage, I draw that many cards. Ooh, I like it. I'm going to tap two for a Lightning Greaves. I'll attach Lightning Greaves to Body of Knowledge. Who's getting bodied by this knowledge? <laughs> well, probably the person who has double digits in life total. <laughs> and just drew a ton of cards. True. Nah. Should I take four? Uh, yep. I'm gonna tap two for a Biomancer's Familiar. So my activate abilities are two less. And I'll pass to Shay. All right, I'm gonna untap. Okay, I'm gonna start by paying two to foretell a card. Mm. You almost said it. <laughs> I heard you almost say it. Uh -huh. Okay. And then I will pay two to cast a young pyromancer. Keeping it very chill. Chill and cool over here. Yeah, I will pay one to move to equip the, the swift foot boots to the pyromancer. Cool. 2 1 with haste. Don't have great attacks with that, but it's got hexproof, and that's cool. Pass the CGB. Uh, on your upkeep, CGB, I'm going to pay 6 for the, the card that I foretold, which is a delayed blast fireball. Yep, we're both dead. So it deals 5 damage to each opponent and each creature they control. Dead. Wow. I uh, didn't feel very delayed. <laughs> no, like just boom, boom, boom. Just a regular old fireball. <laughs> it happened, yeah. Good right. job, Shay, with the victory. Yeah, nice job, Shay. Thanks. <laughs> Let's find our CoolStuffing.com card of the game. And we're back for the CoolStuffInc.com card of the game. Remember to use the promo code WORST when you check out at CoolStuffInc.com and get yourself a discount on the sweet cards you might pick up, like my card of the game, which actually isn't from my deck at all, Primal Amulet. The backside of Primal Amulet being able to copy a spell is really tough to interact with and unstoppable when combined with Delayed Blast Fireball, and we were dead. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty good. How about you, Ben? Card of the game? My my card of the game was my commander, just because it was awesome drawing 15 cards <laughs> just based on his toughness. It's just so cool. And I loved building the deck as I was building it. Mm -hmm. And playing it. I enjoyed yeah. your commander too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cloning your commander was probably the most fun I got to have. So I, I enjoyed that quite a bit. Uh, when I drew six off it, you drew 15. Yep. It's a cool, it's a sweet card. Blake, card of the game. So it's not a card I cast because Shea Hadouken to be first, but. <laughs> It was Rise and Shine. It was in my hand. Oh. I had 14 clues. I was gonna untap, make 14 four fours, and boop you. That would have been exciting. <laughs> but instead I died. <laughs> but it's, Less exciting. Yeah, de then dead. Yeah, that's Commander in But that's a sick card in this deck, so awesome. Yeah. Shay. You yeah, stomped all over Ben's birthday, yeah. but <laughs> but you did it in with the coolest, one of the coolest, I. You share the card. I, I would talk about it. I would gush about it, but you go ahead. Yeah, it's uh, my card of the game is Blood for the Blood God. Uh, yeah, just very high impact uh, in the game, and I got you guys within a shot of that delayed fireball. Mm. 
It, it's like crater hoof in a spell. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> right, kind of. Kind of. That's kinda. how it feels. Yeah. Every time I've tried to cast this, I think two or three times, both on show and off, it's been countered. Every yeah. time. <laughs> Every time. And I feel like I let the blue mages down. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, we all did. We did. Zero, yeah. zero spells countered three blue mages. But they're in there, I promise. I to be fair, I think everyone was tapped out when, yes, I, yeah. when I cast this. That so. shouldn't stop a blue mage. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was a beautiful blood for the blood yes. gods. Thanks. Thanks. All right, you made it to the end of the episode. That's the best thing you can do to support the show. But you can top it off. Hit like, hit subscribe. Wish Ben a happy birthday. Happy birthday, Ben! In the comments. <laughs> and thank you to our sponsors, CoolStuffInc.com and Ultimate Guard. On behalf of everyone here at the Worst Possible Commander Show, you're cool. cool. Ages past. Yeah. Red. Do you not know what that's from? No. <laughs> two lame jokes, two Miz yeah. jokes yeah. in one Shay turn. <laughs> empty chairs. Are, that's what it's going to be in a turn or two. Empty chairs at empty tables. I love that. Where song. Blake will sit no more. <laughs> oh, my friends, my friends, Ben and Blake, you perished. <laughs> Shay burned that. you out from 44. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. That's good. One of these days we're gonna have to release a remix. I know. Worst possible <laughs> <laughs>